I'm here at Nokia World 2011, where Nokia has shown off a handful of new mobile phones, but only one that's destined for the UK, and that's this one here, the Nokia Lumia 800. Now, this handset is a Windows Phone 7 handset. It's the first from Nokia that we've seen since the partnership between Nokia and Microsoft was announced earlier this year. It's got a beautiful unibody injection molded single color casing and a screen on the front which is 3.7 inches it's an amoled screen so very bright and the blacks are really dark now i'm going to take you through a few key specifications on this handset but then i'm going to speak to tim g from the witch mobile team to find out why this windows phone 7 is different from others well onto those specs then well on the rear of the device you've got an 8 megapixel camera which sits behind Carl Zeiss Optics. Now this camera has a 2.2 aperture so that lets plenty of light through to the sensor and should really help shooting in low light conditions. The phone's powered by a 1.4 gigahertz single core processor and there's a 1450 milliamp hour battery which Nokia claims will give about 13 hours of talk time over a 3G connection. Now there's 16 gigabytes of internal memory and the camera's also capable of shooting HD video at 720p resolution. But what I want to know is why this handset is different from other Windows Phone 7 handsets from the likes of HTC, Samsung, LG and Sony Ericsson. So I'm joined by Tim G from our mobile team. So Tim, what's different about this handset from other Windows Phone 7 models? Well, I mean, instead of getting bogged down in kind of a spec or Nokia seem to concentrate more on the experience rather than just necessarily the hardware. They've included a new um, navigation software called Nokia Drive. This gives voice space turn-by-turn -turn navigation. Um, you can also download apps before you go on holiday so you can find your way around without costing you lots for data roaming. They've also introduced Nokia Music, which is an internet-based music service. So it's kind of like a radio. Um, it's called Mix Radio and you can download certain playlists and it's also good because you can use it offline. So maybe if you're travelling on the tube you can download the playlist before you get on and, and that means that that will last for four weeks once you've downloaded it and each playlist is around 20 songs. Finally, they've also got an exclusive app from ESPN, the sports broadcaster. This lets you kind of get down into all the different sports that they cover and get live updates from each league or, or even a specific team and then you can then pin that to the homepage and get quick access to all that information. Okay, thanks Tim. Now the Windows Lumia 800 will go on sale in the UK in November and it will cost around 420 euros to buy outright. When it does go on sale, we'll be buying it and sending it to our labs for a full test. But in the meantime, if you want more information on this model and for hundreds of mobile phone reviews, go to our website at witch.co.uk forward slash mobile.